Capricorns let's see what's coming up for love energy for the month of September you Librans let's see what's coming up hi Librans let's see what's coming out so we're looking at the Librans to see what's coming out there's a lot of same energy that is coming up for you air sign for the month of September so for the Librans in the month of September I see the chocolate guys coming out you liberal chocolate men the focus is going to be on you in the month of September whatever is happening with you liberal chocolate men um, it's going to be coming out okay so the liberal chocolate men you are going to be the focus of this month of September whatever is happening let's see what your what is going to be affecting you so in communication there is going to be friendship that is going to be um, uh, built with relationship and communication and love so first friendship and then relationship which is um, very 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 good okay then we have the issues of uh, um, you um, you know open relationship is something that you want so you chocolate men are thinking about having open relationships so for the liberal Sun moon and rising sign what is going to be their weakness because um, open relationship seems to be coming up a lot especially in the love energies okay so let's see mature women you have a weakness and the weakness could be for a chocolate brown man okay or the weakness could be that you are in a open relationship and you have met this chocolate brown man there's gossip whatever is happening you air sign there's a lot of gossip that is going on so what I'm seeing here is that some of you mature women is gossiping about someone else that you're seeing and it's an open relationship with you and this person but this person is having multiple partners please use a condom oh 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 so um, I'm seeing that uh, because this uh, the, um, you um, Caucasian keeps on coming up in the reading I'm seeing you with a mature man, woman but you want this mature woman to be as friendship beautiful women are coming out and you beautiful women are going to be free you want to be free okay you beautiful women want to be free now what is happening is that uh, there is a fair-skinned male that seems to be um, with a mature woman this mature woman is uh, his or her weakness okay but now he wants a friendship with this person now there is a lot of gossip because this mature woman could be gossiping over what has been happening what has been transpired and um, there is a lot because this uh, um, the Caucasian men are going to be having a lot of passion okay men between the age of 18 and 45 you're going to be having a lot of passion chocolate men once um, their freedom they're in open relationship having different different types of women different things that is going on so let's see what is coming up in communication so in communication we have um, deserve love you are lovable so some of you who are in a open relationship needs to learn that you're lovable you're lovable you don't need to be sharing someone else okay you don't want to be with someone else who is having three four different partners because you're lovable to have someone of your own that you don't need to share okay so that is basically what is coming up for some of you then we have call in your um, soulmate so some of you who are in relationship open relationship you need to call in your soulmate now there's no more time to spend with these people who just do not want to make any decision you need to say hey there is the world take the world because I don't want to be a part of your open relationship okay so this is what is coming up because some people do it and if you know that you want to be in an open relationship you need to find the people who wants to be in an open relationship and not someone who is monogamous monogamous and just want to be with one person and you're playing the game because the thing about it is that the universe have a sense of humor people like you always just left ended up alone because you have wasted the time of other people there's some flirting that is going on 
extended light-hearted energies to other um, you um, um, Caucasian are flirting a lot especially in passion there is a lot of flirting that is going on you're flirting with a mature woman you, there is so much flirting that is going on with you a lot of people are gossiping over you okay um, because of what you're doing because they know that you are in a relationship and they can see it on your face see it in your eyes and you look like a bloody idiot some of you are having this on the work floor and people are looking as at, at you as if uh, um, you know you, you know you're not so right it um, because you have a relationship now give your relationship a chance work on your partnership so whatever is happening, the universe is saying to you guys, give your relationship a chance and work on your relationship because what you're doing, especially you beautiful women, give your relationship a chance, work on your relationship and see where it will go. Um, whatever is happening to you, beautiful women, it's affecting your whole life because, um, you're out there you're all over the place everything is going on for you but you're not really realizing that it is better for you to work on the relationship that you have than you're all over the place flirting because that is not going to basically help because people are looking at you and people are thinking hey um, what is this what is going on okay then we have unrequired love so some of you um, Caucasian or um, <laughs> flirting with someone on the work floor and being an, an bloody ass yeah and it's unrequired love because the person don't really want you the person just thinks you as a flirt and that's the only thing it helps their relationship when they go home at night some of you are going to be receiving some reality check and the reality check is that there's a lot of gossip is going on um, over some of you in this month especially people who are having um, a relationship on the work floor there's a lot of gossip because it's unrequired love because people are already in their relationship and people feels good in their relationship and uh, um, you know they are looking at you as if you know whatever because I don't see um, anything coming out of this it's unrequired love the, the other person is not uh, um, interested in you and it is such a shame because you have some of you have a beautiful relationship and you're doing this so but it's not all of you now there is a mature woman and you there is there is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep a relationship going so there is a mature woman out there and uh, she is realizing that there is not enough attraction and chemistry to keep a relationship going and you know whatever it is there is a Caucasian um, that is out there that is flirting with this mature woman and this mature woman is thinking you know this is unrequired love because I really don't want to be in a relationship with you or with someone that I'm working with and you know it's a waste of time you know you you people need to control yourself and have some control not all of you it's messy it's messy um because um there is so much gossip whatever is happening there is a lot of people that is gossiping over relationships okay beautiful people um young beautiful people just try and give your relationship if you're in a relationship give your relationship a try so for the Libra Sun Moon and Rising sign, what are the other general message that is coming in? You know, people think you deserve love. You don't want to share yourself with someone who is unrequired love. Unrequired love is coming in for you guys. Whatever is happening, there is some unrequired love that is coming in for you guys. Okay, unrequired love. Some of you are going to be ending um, open relationships and go and look for. Um, a partner your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true because some of you are going to be calling in your soulmates and your soulmates are going to be coming in and these people you're going to be connecting with and build a family or have a family okay then we have the eye princess whatever the energy is with eye princess I'm seeing that this person this situation whatever gossip is going on 
you are going to find out about this gossip there's a lot of secrets that have been kept from you some of you are going to be realizing that your partner has been keeping a lot of secrets from you but these secrets are all going to come out and I'm seeing you drop this person like a hot bread okay um the three of Pentacles is that some of you there's a lot of flirting that is going on um, there's definitely a lot of flirting that is going on there is a, little, a lot of open and wishing and that sort of a thing a lot of flirting that is going on but guess what this it is going to come to an end because I'm seeing someone is going to and whoever this as some of you are dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person um, um, I'm seeing that some of you have an eyes on an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person and I'm seeing a Taurus Virgo and a Capricorn coming up so some of you have an eye on these um, two uh, women okay Whew. let's check out what's happening for the singles uh, there is you know people people uh, stop gossiping um, people are gossiping over you and some of you are gossiping okay whoever is flirting people at your work is looking at you and thinking <coughs> yeah you know you know this guy there's something wrong with this guy whatever is that mean there's definitely something wrong with this guy so and be careful because you never know when this sort of a thing just you never know when this sort of a thing just got get out of hands okay <laughs> Anyway, let's uh, look and see what is happening. Let's look and see what is happening. Oh, oh, oh. Passion is here for you guys, so that is good. A lot of passion for the singles. Some of you could be um, going on short vacation, long weekends. Okay, and fun times. So this is good for you singles. At least you're not at home. You know, that is just fun for you. At least you're not at home. Okay, at least you are not at home, you singles, which is just so beautiful. So finance and career. So um, a lot of you singles, um, finance and career seems to be affecting why you have mad relationships, where some of you could be just working hard to keep your head above water. You're more interested in your work, and that is the reason. Some of you are definitely going to be meeting your divine partner, okay? So this could be a soulmate or a twin flame. It's worth waiting for. Divine timing is what is going to be happening for some of you singles. Divine timing. So just give it um, time because very soon some of you definitely are going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate. Okay, so give it. It's divine timing. Whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring is divine timing. Divine timing is in this because you are going to be about to meet your twin flame or soulmate so it's everything is happening in divine time and so just let it be don't push it enjoy yourself have enough passion but wear your condoms it's very important and um, very very soon you're going to be meeting your twin flame or soul flame it has to do with this divine timing okay Sometimes um, we push along, along against the flow and we meet these real horrible people. And sometimes we just have to understand that it is divine timing um, that is um, working for you. Okay. So <laughs> let's um, see what's coming up for partners. So we see the wallflowers. Some of you have become wallflowers and uh, money. Is the issue some of you could be just working hard and don't have any time for the BS um, you men 45 years and older is working hard your wife is at home looking as if what happened but he's not cheating he's just working very hard he just wants to make you happy freedom communication with the soulmate I'm seeing some of you are connecting with your soulmate some of you found your soulmate and is um, connecting with your soulmate. I'm seeing a true gem coming in. This is a young man who really cares deeply about you. Um, and um, 
uh, okay ah uh, okay so some of you women are feeling like a wallflower because your husband is always out you have the money but he's always out yes because the men 45 years and older are definitely working hard to protect and make sure that your wife your kids have a good life and this is good there's nothing wrong with that basically sometimes women just you know find something and do you don't have to sit as a wallflower he's not doing anything you know that sort of a thing he's just not doing anything um you know being stabbed in the back whatever is happening some of you are going to be stabbed in the back um by um your husband okay you could be getting divorced you could be getting separated you're going to be stabbed in the back by your husband some of you are working hard to balance out a soulmate relationship um some of you are looking for your freedom because you have found your soulmate so you could be in a relationship but you are trying to balance out your uh, this relationship because you you have met your soulmate and you're trying to balance out. For some of you, you're really working on your soulmate relationship. I am seeing someone here who have um, at work, you want to date someone. So you're in a relationship, you're in a beautiful relationship, but you saw someone who wants you want to date at work now be careful about this be careful about what you're doing because some of you are just in this beautiful relationship but you are basically dating someone at work and it's you know the universe have a funny way and <laughs> of doing things because the universe is realizing that you have a very good relationship but yet still you're messing it up because uh, um, you are basically basically messing around and you know whatever the issues and the situation is be careful because the universe have a sense of humor ladies and gentlemen and I'm seeing someone here who um, is in a beautiful relationship but yet still they're dating other people at their workplace and that sort of a thing and what is going to be happening and transpiring is that you're going to be finding out the truth of this okay so whatever is going on and whatever that is transpiring be careful what some of you in relationship do because the day you decide to date this person at work because you have been dating a lot of people at your work this is going to come back to the person you're in relationship to and it's going to mess you up so be careful what you guys out there are doing because it's going to come back and mess you up Ladies and gentlemen, let me know how your reading goes because I am going to say to you, a lot of you are working on your soulmate relationship because some of you find out that your soulmate is uh, is good. Some of you who are married or in a relationship and getting divorced, um, your husband or is going to be stabbing you in the back because he's not going to give you what you need to um, the money because you have not been doing anything for yourself and uh, he's not going to give you the money that you deserve to have okay um, because you have been just an out housewife um, he's gonna divorce you and because you're not aware of what you're supposed to get he's gonna stab you in the back and not giving you what you're supposed to receive okay so be aware of that I'm saying I love you guys